Hey, what's going on, guys? Dr. Sean J. Harris here, Generational Wealth Academy, here with my buddy, Caden. Hey, guys. Hey, listen, I always like to pull out the camera when I'm doing a teaching lesson to make it a teachable point for everybody. So, Caden, we are here at Walmart. We're coming in and just pick up a couple little items. But if you look here, what do we see there? That's the pickup line, right? Yeah. Look at that. Not a car in sight. But as we pan back over here, the parking lot is full. So what's happening is people could have convenience, pick up the item and keep going from over here at this spot. But most people are actually still going into the store, which gives them a higher propensity to spend more money than what they were going to spend by just knowing that you had a dedicated order with four or five items or whatever you're going to pick up. But now once you get inside, you have more opportunities to make more purchases. So you probably remember a couple years ago, I did a video with Kennedy. We were at the, at the gas station and I showed her that in certain communities, people tend to pay inside with cash instead of pay, bless you, instead of pay at the pump. So when you pay at the pump, you go in, uh, you don't have to go in. So you buy your gas, you get out. But when you use cash and you go inside to pay with cash, you're probably gonna end up buying something else like some hot chocolate or some candy or some stuff like that. And then what happens is you come back out to pump the gas and then you realize, uh oh, my tank didn't hold enough that I paid for, so I gotta go back and get my change, which gives you a second opportunity to possibly spend money on maybe a lottery ticket that you didn't want to spend money on. So a lot of times people, the, the marketing strategy is designed to get you in the store because you will end up buying candy like daddy. I'm gonna be honest, I'm probably gonna go ahead and buy a Kit Kat. That wasn't on my list, but I'm probably gonna get me a Kit Kat. And, uh, but that's how um, marketing works. So that's a point that I just wanted to kind of point out to you as we are walking into the store and wondering why all of the pickups are empty and the parking lot is full. All right, guys, these are the skills that you have to teach your kids on a day-to-day -day basis as you're living them in real life. These are some of the secrets to what Tara and I do. A lot of times people wonder, well, how are your kids so uh, financially versed and know about uh, economics and finance and business? Well, it's stuff like this. We teach as we go in real time. All right, guys, stop showing your hair. It's making back, make money while you're doing it. And remember, if Caden can, you can too.